The other half of the stethoscope is going to be your blood pressure gauge. It's something you really need to look at, and again, it's going to be something that you need to be concerned about how it feels in your hand, just like the handles for the diagnostic set. With the blood pressure gauge, with this one, which is called the DS58, this one's going to sit in my hand pretty evenly, well balanced, and then I can rotate the thumb screw on the bottom to control the, the pressure, and then I can get my readings. Whether I'm left-handed or right-handed, this fits in here pretty nice. Now, this specific gauge and the other gauges we're going to show you, they come with either a couple cuffs or a family practice kit, which has multiple cuffs, which I highly recommend because it will cover all your patients. And you could use it in the future. The other thing that's nice is to, to get between our different size cuffs, all we do is rotate. It's on and off. When we talked about the calibration earlier, if you look right there closely at the gauge, you'll see at the very bottom the calibration check. So you always know that you're getting an accurate reading. Let's talk about the next one. The other gauge out there is called the DS66. Basically, this one is going to be more of a trigger release when it comes to the air pressure, unlike the thumb screw from the DS58. Again, it goes with feel. So whether you like the lithium ion handle or the C cell battery handle, you're going to be kind of figuring this out too. They're both real good and real quality, but most importantly, they, but again, this has a calibration check. It lets us know that we're taking accurate blood pressures. This is probably the most important part to remember from this, especially when you take your boards and you take your blood pressure. You want to get that right. Again, we can get this with a couple cuffs or we can get this with a family practice kit. And this is, again, easy to maneuver and get through. It is just a gauge, but you should make sure it's calibrated. Another gauge that you probably might have seen, uh, you'll see it at your doctor's offices, where you have kind of this blood pressure bowl and again kind of a thumb screw release. They do offer this at the schools too. The gauge actually has a calibration check which is very nice and it pops off between different size cuffs. This is all good. The one thing that you need to be aware of though when you're using this, as I put this on my arm and I rotate around, sometimes when you rotate around the patient the cuff will actually cover your gauge. So that might bother you. So take a peek at that when you're looking at these gauges. The main thing is they all got great warranties while you're in school.